All right, everyone, welcome back to CIO Insight here on the PulseNetwork.com. I am Tyler Pyman. Time to talk a little bit about Google. And of course, if we're going to be talking <laughs> Google, Eric, it seems like the last couple of weeks, every we week, talk Google. You need two things. We got to talk about Google and we got to do it with Jason, right? That's of the rule. Of course, without a doubt. So, yeah. without further ado, we welcome in Jason Brooks uh, of eWeek Labs. Jason, welcome in. How are you? I'm doing pretty well, just plussing my life away over here. <laughs> <laughs> and what's going to be our educational lesson for the week, Jason? Well, uh, this week we have uh, the, the long-awaited brand pages have arrived uh, on Google+. So um, I'm, I'm sure as everyone uh, intimately remembers, because this is you know, one of the chief uh, joys of our lives, paying <laughs> <a> close attention <laughs> to this, right when Google+, Plus first came out in uh, July, uh, a bunch of uh, people went out and just as they do on Twitter, you know, uh, just uh, made uh, pages for their brands. And uh, so, but very quickly, Google came out, deleted those brand pages, and said, hey, this is all about real people, real names, and we will have brand pages at some point for, for you, uh, but for now, uh, only real people allowed. So we're deleting all the other accounts. And so, uh, so this week, uh, they came out with that uh, brand page support that uh, they promised months back. You know, it's just the state of the social networks that we have right now is that there's a place for companies on all of them. You know, that's just how, uh, you know, what people expect. And, and there's a, a bunch of things that a company can do to reach out to its uh, its customers and users and, and try to push out information, get discussion, this and that. So it is definitely a key thing that uh, for them to, to have. And, and then, but the big questions are around, how is it implemented? You know, how is it different than Facebook and then in Twitter? And uh, unsurprisingly, uh, there are things that people are unhappy about. <laughs> you know, there are there are there's uh, ample evidence of the uh, the beta tag. You know, that that belongs on on most Google products uh, at this point. And and they're just starting to work out some of the kinks. So one of the things that I, I've been reading about that I keep hearing is, you know, the, the idea of that only one person can actually be linked up to that account. Whereas, you know, Facebook, I mean, here at the Pulse Network, we have several people that are operating uh, the different Facebook pages with, with Google. It's literally just one person's account that can actually operate this. That seems like it could be a big problem for some of these major corporations, <laughs> Johnny right? Walmart. Yeah, Walmart. exactly. <laughs> Definitely. Now that I'm glad you brought that up because that's something that, that we can't not talk about because that's a huge issue, right? Uh, you go out. I made on uh, the day that the feature came out. I made a page for Week Labs, and uh, you know I'm the only person who now can update that page. So I think one of two things is going to happen. Either one, Google is going to add the support. Uh, for multiple admins uh, in, some, in a similar way to what Facebook does where you can you can assign people as admins or the second thing and this is more how Twitter works Twitter all the accounts on Twitter are single user accounts but you can use a third party tool that knows how to access your Twitter account and then multiple people can log into that tool and go from there now right now Google doesn't have the kind of API pieces in place that they would need to allow a service like that to exist. All the Google Plus APIs are read-only right now. So there isn't a way to make your third-party tool to log in with common credentials. And, and the other thing is that since your Google credentials are your, in a lot of cases, your Gmail account, and that's something that you don't want to be uh, sharing, you right. know, among mm -hmm. your, and someone jokingly said, oh, just post the credentials, you know, onto the Google Plus page, <laughs> and uh, then anyone can update it. You know, so that, that's, Google has, uh, that's one of the first things that people have, have, uh, have commented on and, have, have, you know, they're, they're upset about it, and uh, rightly so. And Google has said they're working, burning the midnight oil. I mean, they're, they're working really hard on that particular issue because it's a big one. And, uh, you know, it's just another way that this is, you know, early days in this, and uh, they're, they're working out kinks. But I'd say that is the biggest one.